What's up, guys? I'm DragonBees, and uh, just to address it before we start, I will be doing uh, the anime reaction solo for a little while. Um, I'm currently away um, and dealing with some personal stuff. I did uh, put that in a community post thing on YouTube. It's been all over social media and stuff as well to let people know. But yeah, for now, Danny won't be in the reactions. Um, one day he might be back in them, um, but he's doing his own thing at the moment. Um, everything's okay with me and him in the grand scheme of things. But for now, it's just going to be me. I'm currently in Norway, hence the, the background's a little different. For those who do follow my content, Paddle is literally sitting that side of me. Um, Hello. So he's just doing his thing. <laughs> I'm just being fly for the reaction. Um, but yeah, so Paddle's not actually watching the reaction, but you might see Paddle milling around or doing something, or you might see a doggo or a, a Paddle mother. <laughs> <laughs> Petal mother. Okay. Um, so yes. Anyway, let's get on to the reaction. So we are. Re I am reacting to uh, the next episode of the first season of Pokemon. Um, and with everything that's going on, it had to be a hard one to do, even if I, Danny and I were recording together, because this episode is Pikachu's goodbye, and it's got one of my favourite pieces of music in it in the series ever, um, which is the time is now, um, and it's. Very emotional, so there is some very poignant words in there that um, might spark some emotion even more than it would normally. So bear with me if I start crying, because I can already feel it knowing what this episode's about, but we might as well just jump straight in and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Still, I get to listen to the, the original theme. You know, it's amazing. Uh, uh, Jonathan Page sung this, well, he sings it all the time, but like recently I've seen a video of him singing it and he sounds exactly the same. It's insane. Because this has been, what, 25 years or whatever? I still have coffee. Not in one of my coffee mugs that I have, but you know, it's a nice colour. <laughs> so. Do, 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 do. Teach you. I've forgotten how much happens in season one. Like in such a short time. Because at this point he's got six badges, so they are eventually going to head to Cinnabar, I believe. Oh lord. That's a, that's a throwback to a couple episodes ago, the whole Kangaskhan thing. The little one! Ah, oh, the baby Pika. Even though at this point... Well, we don't know about Pichu at this point because this is pre-Gen 2, obviously. Oh my god. What I like about this as well, even though it's not really how it works for the most part, is that each Pikachu here has a slightly different uh, look to them. Some have got like scruffy hair, some of them have got like bits of hair missing on their tail. One had a bent ear, I noticed. Look at them all. Aww. 
So they're frightened of Pikachu because he's not a wild Pikachu anymore. Except this little one. It's always the little ones that are like, uh... <laughs> I suppose the impression we're meant to get here is that, that that's a baby Pikachu. Ah. Uh... Oh, Lord. Oh god, they're swarming. <laughs> it looks like they finally accepted Pikachu as part of their group. Oh no. Oh Ash, you idiot. You're not a Pikachu. I was gonna say, if you think about it, Ash, they're, they're out in the they're out in the middle of nowhere. They're not they're wild, and you're a trainer. Like, use your brain. A Pika Paradise. Oh, look at the little one. The little one's cute. Uh oh. Well. Oh god. Oh, I remember this bit. They chain themselves together like a like a Pikachu rope. <laughs> Here they go. <laughs> it looks so stupid. Oh lord. <laughs> oh, this is funny. <laughs> I love how they've just delicately laid out, like, the leaves there, and they brought him an apple, and they're so sweet. You know, as much hate as Pikachu get because, you know, the oversaturation of Pikachu being a mascot, but, you know. They are cute. They are adorable. The, the fact that Pikachu wasn't even going to be the mascot in the first place, Clefairy was... Clefairy was the original plan. I, th I don't. Th I think it would have been a different story if it was Clefairy. Oh, Lord. Oh. Oh, that's so cute. Oh. <laughs> Pikachu 
the pizza I had inside. Looks like it. Misty, Ash, dinner will be ready in just a few minutes. Oh, it looks like Pikachu sure is fitting in well. Yeah. I think it's the best thing in the world for Pikachu to be here with its own kind. Huh? Oh. Thanks, Brock. That was a delicious dinner. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a great cook. Modest, too. <laughs> Don't you think so, Ash? Ash? Hey, Ash. Uh, Ash, what's wrong? Is something bothering you? You don't look so good. You feel okay? Just realized something. They're saying that he's a good cook, but they're eating they're eating food out of a can. <laughs> I just noticed that because Ash still had like the ring pull thing on the can. He's like, Missy's like, you're a great cook, bro. They're eating out of a can. That's not <laughs> translation in the early time uh, was uh, a little bit dodge. It's always a net. It's always a net. A net or a pitfall trap. Also, there's a lot more Pikachu. There's a lot more Pikachu there than there were in earlier bits. You know, if Team Rocket spent as much time as they did with their theatrics and that, they would actually be successful. Because, my God, can they put theatrics on? No, they're, they're, they're literally like, let's set up some spotlights and let's set up some, you know... <laughs> So I love Misty's telling Pikachu what to do. Although I guess that's a that's a th even though it's Ash's Pikachu, Pikachu's always loved Misty, so it's like, yeah, I guess so. Still though, it's a little bit sketchy. So I just want to point out, Ash, you've got other Pokemon. Why are you not using them? Nom 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 nom. Look at him go. Aww. <laughs> the 
the, the, the landing animation. The fact they've all got different little voices too is very kind of cool. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, there they go. They're doing their little celebration cheers. Oh, look at his little face. Pikachu will be better off staying here than traveling around with me. 
that you will be happier this way. Kind of strange to think that the reaction or the, the way that this would have gone if he didn't like if, if Pikachu stayed not that that would have happened because you know but like and that song that so that song's one of my favorite songs like even outside of Pokemon there's just something about that song that always just yeah It'd be cool if they revisit this this group of Pikachu and that little sort of finale thing they're doing for Ash now. It'll be, it, but I, there's there's so much that I need to cover in that. I doubt it. Well, that's the end of that episode. I, it, it is one of those, like, iconic episodes, and it's always been one of my favourites from the first season, um, even though it's like, oh my god, Ash, why are you getting rid of Pikachu kind of thing? Um, I remember watching it, like, when it first came out, and it was just like this roller coaster of, is he legit going like, to get rid of his Pikachu? Because it wasn't that long ago that he was like, hey, Butterfree, go have a life. I'm like, oh god, he's going to do it with Pikachu, so... Um, but, you know, a little bit different being his starter and the mascot and everything else, but yeah. And I managed to hold myself together. I was, I did, I did have a, a tear or two, but I was okay. <laughs> as soon as the music started, as soon as it started, I'm like, oh God. <laughs> um, but yeah, it, it's, it's a good episode. Like, you know, if, if I had to say what, you know, it, one of my favorite episodes in season one is, it would be this. Um, so, but yeah, anyway, um, Thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell. Then you know when videos go live. I do stream on Twitch. Um, normally with a re regular schedule, but at the moment it's a bit all over the place, obviously with personal circumstances. But I'm trying to sort of keep up a bit now that I've semi had a chance to breathe. Um, and yeah, um, make sure you check out all the other content on the channel. There's all sorts of stuff, shiny reactions. We are, I, I am, I am going to continue to react to Ultimate Journeys. Um, Danny's just going to watch them to the side, um, to his own pace. Um, but yeah, I will be continuing to react because I know people have already asked about that. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching. Hopefully things will get back to normal over the coming months. But um, for now, it's just going to be a bit of a, bit of a mess, more than usual. You know, I mean, it's always a mess, but we'll see. Um, but thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.